This morning, students at Southwick Regional School are returning to their classrooms after February break following allegations of racist bullying. Wait, to news reporter Kiara Smith is live in Southwick with how school officials are responding. Rich Taylor, the principal at Southwick Regional School, says that today there will be heavy police presence. Principal Serena Shorter says this will help to provide reassurance and support to the school community, ensuring that everyone feels safe and secure. Shorter says she will be holding class meetings to discuss the incident with students and staff. Allegations stem from Allison Lopez, who says her daughter was one of multiple students who had a bid placed on her during an online slave auction held over social media. Lopez also says her daughter was the victim of racist harassment. An online petition with over 1,300 signatures also calls for accountability from students, parents, and administrators at Southwick Regional School. The district also says it will offer counseling and support services to students. Superintendent Jennifer Willard said the district conducted an investigation and 22 News did ask if she could share any of the consequences or disciplinary actions that the students who were allegedly involved would face, but she was unable to answer due to privacy concerns for the students. Working for you live in Southwick, Kiara Smith, 22 News.